And in this video, we'll take a look at how much was Johnny Depp set to make for Pirate 6 before being fired. Johnny Depp is one of the most well-known actors of his generation, and the man has a resume that any performer would envy. Depp has not always taken advantage of major opportunities, but he has done amazing work in blockbuster hits, and his co-stars have praised him. Depp has made millions of dollars and spent them on unique items. The actor was due for a large pay in the near future, but his current financial situation prevented that from happening. Let's take a closer look at Johnny Depp and how he missed out on millions of dollars. Back in the 1980s, a man named Johnny Depp broke into the entertainment industry, and he would go on to become one of the biggest and most bankable stars in the world over the next several decades. It all began for the actor on the small screen, as 21 Jump Street proved to be the ideal starring vehicle early on. Many actors would be content with this, but not Depp. Instead, he aimed for the big screen, and once he got his chance to shine, he blossomed into a star that fans couldn't get enough of. Depp proved that he could do it all, and do it well, whether he was turning heads as Edward Scissorhands, wowing audiences in films like Blow, or acting as a heartthrob in Cry Baby. The actor has had many iconic roles and projects, but none come close to matching what he accomplished as his swashbuckling pirate, Pirates of the Caribbean. Curse of the Black Pearl was a surprise box office hit in 2003, and Disney had a massive live-action franchise on its hands in the blink of an eye. It was a once-in-a-lifetime idea that worked and Johnny Depp's Captain Jack Sparrow was the star. Depp was an excellent choice for the role, and he would go on to star in five Pirates films, grossing billions of dollars at the box office. Johnny Depp amassed a fortune as a result of the film's success and the popularity of Captain Jack Sparrow. Johnny earned $10 million for his first appearance as Jack Sparrow in 2003's Pirates of the Caribbean, The Curse of the Black Pearl. His base salary for the second installment of Pirates was $20 million. Rebecca Ken points earned her an additional $40 million, bringing her total earnings to $60 million. Celebrity Net Worth reports that he earned a total of $55 million from the third Pirates film. A sixth Pirates film has been in the works for some time, but Depp will not be returning for one last ride. Fans are undoubtedly aware of the legal proceedings between Johnny Depp and Amber Heard, as it is all the news outlets want to talk about. A lot has been revealed, including how much money Depp was supposed to make for a sixth Pirates of the Caribbean film. According to Insider, Depp's manager, Jack Wyam, testified in his defamation trial against his ex-wife that Disney's movie chief Sean Bailey and Pirates of the Caribbean. Producer Jerry Bruckheimer verbally agreed to pay Depp $22.5 million for the sixth film in the series in around 2016. But Depp never saw the million dollars. The sixth Pirates film was never made and Depp was never given the opportunity to reprise his role as Captain Jack Sparrow. That is an unfathomable sum of money to lose, and it is just one of many ways in which the parties involved have been impacted during this turbulent time. Depp wanted to play Captain Jack Sparrow one more time as a send-off, but he was denied the opportunity. I felt that these characters should be able to say their proper farewells. A franchise can only last so long, and there is a way to end a franchise like that, and I thought the characters deserved a way out to end the franchise on a high note. I intended to keep going until it was time to stop," the actor explained. Penelope Cruz co-stars with Johnny Depp in the 2011 film Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tides, and it appears that the actress enjoyed her time with Depp. I've seen Johnny in a variety of situations, and he is always courteous to everyone around him. He's one of the most generous people I've ever met," Cruz stated. During my first pregnancy, I spent every single day with him while we were filming Pirates of the Caribbean. My husband and I will never forget the sweetness, protection, and kindness he showed me throughout the entire process. Johnny Depp is still fighting his ex-wife Amber Heard in court, but there's a wild fan theory that he's dating his attorney, Camille Vasquez. According to Hollywood Life, there are a number of viral TikTok videos circulating that claim the two are romantically involved based on their body language. Johnny and Camille appear to be at ease with each other, according to video footage from the court proceedings. 
As they exit the court, the couple can be seen whispering in each other's ears, smiling and waving. However, a source close to Camille told TMZ that the couple's relationship is strictly professional. We've been told they're not dating, the publication says. Johnny hasn't been linked to anyone publicly since his divorce from Amber. After meeting on the set of 2011's The Rum Diary, the couple married in 2015. The following year, Amber filed for divorce and was granted a restraining order against the actor. In the years since, both parties have made allegations of abuse against the other. Johnny ended up suing his ex-wife for defamation after she wrote an op-ed for The Washington Post in 2018 about surviving domestic abuse. The case is currently being litigated in court. Amber recently claimed on the stand that Johnny was abusive in previous relationships. She brought up an alleged incident between Johnny and his ex-girlfriend Kate Moss, in which Amber claims Johnny shoved the supermodel down the stairs. Amber claimed that Johnny was arguing with her sister Whitney in front of a staircase, prompting the Aquaman star to strike her then-husband. I don't hesitate, I don't wait, I just think of Kate Moss and stairs, she explained, and then I swung him, Amber added. I hadn't landed a blow in my entire relationship with Johnny up to this point, and I hit him for the first time, like, really hit him, straight in the face. Kate has never accused Johnny of physical abuse and has not responded to Amber's claims. The case is still ongoing and Johnny is seeking unspecified restitution for the harm done to his reputation, including the loss of a multi-million dollar role in a new Pirates film. And with that being said, it's time to end our video. What are your views about this? Let us know in the comments. Like this video and make sure to subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos like this. We'll see you in the next video.